Hey guys, welcome to the BD Themes widget tutorial. Today, we are going to talk about the cursor effects extension presented by Element Pack Pro. To activate this effect, click on the Element Pack Pro tab from your WordPress dashboard and then go to the Extensions tab. There, find and turn on the cursor effect switcher and save settings. Now go to your target page and reload it. Next, click on the advanced heading widget and go to the advanced tab. There, you can see the cursor effects option below the tooltip. Click on the option and turn on the switcher. Now hover over the advanced heading part of your page and you'll see a circle following your cursor movements. This animation is called the cursor effects. From the option, you can select the animation source from four different items. The default is the circle you have seen and that left us with text, images and icons. Just select icons and you'll see an icon as the hover cursor effect. Go to the style part and change the size of the icon. Just see for yourself. Now select text and then put down the words you want to show as the cursor effect. You can disable the default cursor to show only the effect on the page. For text, you get a completely different set of options to style it. Let's change the background color first. Then the text color. Add some padding. And border radius on top. Also, you can change the font style from typography like this. And just like that, you can make a unique cursor style using the cursor effect feature. Just hover around and enjoy. This feature can be used on any widget like the image widget here. Same way before, click on the image and go to the advanced tab and turn on the cursor effect switcher. Now for the effect, choose an image as the style and pick a cursor image from the library. Like that, the image will be displayed as the cursor over the content area now. This is amazing, right? You can turn off the disable default cursor switcher to make the original cursor appear on top of the page like this. Then you can change the image size or something to match your test. Well, that's all about the cursor effects extension. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. See you next time.